So here we are at Beyond the Horizon, mission number two. We're going to do the one lap challenge. It's the Nissan Showdown. We're in the GTR Nismo 17. What we'll see is a slightly different approach to the start of the race, but interestingly enough, it's Tokyo Expressway. And I've never tried this one before. As usual, you can see the start time and my mileage in the top right hand corner. You can check that later. Assist settings, traction control one, ABS default, everything else off. For all of you that know me, that is my default. So just like I say, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching. Thank you for choosing to watch this guidance to show you how to beat the gold. So here we go, the different approach to the start line. We're going to do a staggered start approach where we're going to race against three Nissans in age. So the first one's gone, the 94 V-Spec, the 97 V-Spec, And the V-Spec 2 at Nur away. And here we are. This is us revving. And away we go. We've got to change up gears. You've got to pick the precise point to change with a little bit of Honda thrash on the rev limits. It isn't a Honda, but you can still thrash it. So we're going to chase the uh, first car down. We're going to aim to catch that for the first corner. If you remember and recall this track, it's slightly up the off ramp. And then we're going to do a 180 round two, two bends. But we're going to have to break way before we get to this guy. So we're going to have to break just before the start of the hill. Here we go, down a fourth, down a third, make the corner in third, and then change down a second to push out of it. So we'll start to swing wide. Chase up to third. Hold the corner down to second to hold it. We're starting to slide out. Keep behind this guy. Now you'll remember this, if you remember the early missions. We're going to run down here in fourth, up into fifth. We're going to slipstream this guy and slingshot past him in fifth. Gonna hold the throttle, not 100% round that corner. Keep the throttle balanced. Leasing off a fraction. We know we've got a tight corner here. Breaking on the start of those stripes down to third. Push through up to fourth. Then we're gonna come through this corner in fifth. Nicely balanced for a change down to fourth. We're gonna induce a slide here just to get the back end round. If we get the power down again early, we're about to catch the next car. Fourth gear around this corner, we're going to take the off ramp and we're going to slow down the third gear for this corner. And unfortunately, I give this fella a little bit of a tap, but not enough to get us disqualified, thankfully. What I realised at this point is you can hit the walls, you can use the walls on this test, you don't get disqualified. So there he is, number three in our sights, coming down the hill up into fifth gear. Remember the braking point from this one, this is 200 metres. Break on the 200 metres when you see it, so it's probably more like 175. Down to second, treat this as one corner, one continuous corner, get it all the way around. And look at that, it's well within our sights. Now up to third, hit the apex. Now we're pushing for the line, and we've actually done really quite well here, folks. We're going to catch him halfway to the finish. We're going to have him with overspeed, and we're going to get the slipstream as well. Charging down in sixth gear, race past him there's the finish we've done him quite easily there we go so the couple of time couple of areas for improvement there turn one i think we could have break later got into there faster probably passed that guy before we left that corner there we go we come second a 239 864 about 300 three tenths behind a friend 